yeah the component i will deal with this one later and rock rock fluid interaction yeah we will deal with this one also later okay but i want to in this video i want to directly go to the wells and recurrent and let's expand the dates and then click on that one i want to add range of date click on this one i mean this one starting from january 1st 2000 i want to expand it to surprise surprise it should be the year 10 3000 so you know we are playing with the ccs co2 injection co2 sequestration it needs relatively not relatively absolutely longer period of time of observation so that's okay we we can play with that 1000 okay from the starting point of the simulation to the the time of completion so click on okay so step one but to make the calculation faster we just want to do the calculation annually so step one and then year okay and click on okay 1000 new dates have been added okay so we will go to the bottom and we will stop at this one click on okay there so yep click close okay so the date's already good we have from the year 2000 down to surprise surprise down to the year 3000 and then we stop there okay let's squeeze it and then let's go to the wells double click okay so i want to add injection well okay and i call this one co2 underscore injector And we are going to add a CO2 injector at the center of the reservoir. And we will have constraints. And the constraints, yeah. by the way, here the type is injector, uh, no group. OK. And in order to keep the new type of constraint, has to be set to, of course. Later, I will put some constraints. And simulation date, yes, the year 2000, January 1st. And then let's go to constraints. OK, and let's expand the window, can we? Yes. Let's put the constraints. So the first constraint is, click on that one, operate. So for the operate, I'm going to select STG surface gas rate maximum and the maximum value for my surface gas rate let's say is the 21,500 meter cube per day and I'm going to select count repeat okay and add another constraint operate and now we will play with the bottom hole pressure. I want to inject maximum at that value, at that injection, at that rate, I mean. But the bottom hole pressure maximum, bottom hole injection pressure of 44,500 kilopascal. Again, it's count and repeat. Maximum number of continue repeat allowed, one. OK. And then history matching, operate his, OK. And please provide required data, injected fluid properties. OK, later we will deal with this one. OK, injected fluid properties. 
and injected fluid okay injected fluid we are going to select solvent okay and for this one let's go to this one first multiplier injected fluid solvent yeah, we need to deal with the fluid later. Okay. And constraints. Okay. So far, so good. And then later we will multiply. Okay. Click on okay first. All right. Yeah. Yeah, we need to, you know, we need to input the injected fluid properties, but later I'm going to deal with the fluid and rock properties later. And then we will go to the well events, double click on that. 